y'all, I'm your host Demon Faze Yoshi, and welcome to another episode of Anime Corner 21st Gaming. Um, we're continuing on with the story of Kingdom Hearts. I'm gonna really try my hardest to get through these games. So let's uh, let's do this. Sorry guys, I'm just not really a fan of this freaking game. I don't care. Excuse me, that might have been loud for our audience. Yep. Quite accomplished, that Riku. Running off with that girl without even saying goodbye. Run off where? Tell me, where did he go? To the ruins of Hollow Bastion. Where yeah, Peter Pan goofy ass is gonna float through here. <laughs> you It's too dorky to be looking like a villain. Why, Sora? Just believe, and you can do it. <laughs> okay, this is uh, this is becoming very funny. Now we get the straight. Oh. Okay. Let's see what Peter Pan can do. I'll trade him in for Goofy. Uh, okay. Oh, 
that's dope. like one of those uh, flying things. Irritating. Myself a good time here. Uh, <laughs> now, I was checking out some new anime news. Uh, I heard that Jump Force is adding Yubi to the to the lineup, which is pretty funny. Cause I want to know is he gonna, you know, is he gonna get them kick-ass monsters? He's gonna throw them on somehow, or <laughs> he got some karate moves we don't know about. I like how that went down. Well, yeah, Jump Force is looking pretty, uh, looking pretty good right now so far, and I'm very, and I'm also even hyped up about the character creations. So Jump Force is gonna have character creations. Yes, that game is really gonna become, you know, everybody's most favorite game because everybody can create their own Super Saiyan slash Hokage or. Uh, 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 airbender, whatever they can create almost anything on uh, Jump Force. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be very dope. It's going to be a really interesting, really interesting, uh, not only that, um, I plan, I'll, I'll also plan to get My Hero Academia the game as well. I have Peter Pan there with me. boss battle though. I, I give it credit where credit is due. You know, try to talk to you guys and then talk about 
you know, up and coming anime news that's happening right now at this moment is like kind of hard to do to me <laughs> because I like to like focus because this is my first time playing Kingdom Hearts. Honestly, I never played Kingdom Hearts before. Never have, never will. This is my first experience and experience in playing this, and now. So far, the gameplay is pretty awesome. It, it, it is pretty awesome. It's pretty cool. But the thing I just can't get over is just Disney characters being in this. Can't believe it. They really flew. Wait till I tell Kyrie. I wonder if she'll believe me. Probably not. You can bring her to Neverland sometime. Then she can try it herself. If you believe, you can do anything, right? I know I will. There's so much I want to tell her about flying the pirates, pirates. and everything else that's happened. What's that thing? What about the clock tower? You say there's something there. What, Quasimodo? Ah, <laughs> oh, don't tell me that's where we're going. I think I spoke too soon. Pro probably, maybe, maybe, hopefully, hopefully not, maybe. Okay, good. No, 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 no. We're still in the Peter Pan story. Good. Yeah, but my whole thing with Disney characters being in this game is just like, uh, alrighty then. <coughs> so, where do I go from here? So what do I do here? Three hours later. So what I didn't pay attention to uh, just a second ago is that whole, like, you go around the clock and you see, you know, something is odd with the timing. It, it was crazy. It, I, I spent, like, damn near at least, like, 15 minutes flying around trying to find it. So... where this is going. Hmm. Let's look at some backstory here. Not this kid stuff. First of all, where are y'all parents at anyway? I don't see no adult, well, except maybe a few in the game. That's not the point. I don't see no adult on that island. So. Not this kid stuff. I'm like, first of all, this, you know, I'm, I'm not going to say much. I'm going to leave my logic at the door. That's what I'm going to do. Leave my logic at the freaking door. Because I am not going to get my brain broken on this whole story here. Followed her here through sheer force of will. But fear not. 
So he becomes the Green Ranger now. Neat. I wouldn't be surprised about that either. Uh, Disney have their hands in yeah. freaking Power Rangers Are too. Are we going back to Neverland? Afraid so. But we can see each other anytime. As long as you don't forget about Neverland, that is. <laughs> A fairy harp? Huh. So I got a new weapon now. Let's see what I got. Whoa. Okay, kick ass. Time for the nav for the gummy navy ship, whatever the crap. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta go back to town, get them the gummy piece or something, and then that's pretty much it, right? Oh wait, there's a trinity. Go about that. Sorry, I go to sit vicious. <laughs> All right, and talk to him. See what he's talking about. Oh, you're doing this putting some gummy pieces together and everything. That's it. True. It's a gummy ship, right? cheesy, you know, believe in myself type storylines where you know, the antagonist this is sudden burst of power, you know, awesome, you know all in one My Hero Academia shit I mean, I got nothing against it, I just felt, I felt it was kind of cheesy on this part story very odd like what the, I'm, I'm kind of lost like does the heartless come out every time you know there's a you know a door lock symbol 
pop up or something or anything. I, I, I don't know. I am so lost. I can't see how this game is the etch to every child's, you know, memories. Back in the 2000s and everything. I don't see how this game is like any anything memorable. Like, I don't know. Maybe just me. Maybe just because it's my disliking for the game. But... Maybe just me. Maybe it is me. So all the parents disappeared? <laughs> D and he's already zoned out. Did you call me? these freaking doors here. That's all I'm gonna do. Maybe there's something out here to this story. Alright. Story continues. Revisit some of the old worlds. Huh. Three hours later. Okay, so I did not see this here, and I'm getting very fucking pissed off. So, so I gotta, guess I gotta go back here, select the world. And then, bam. So, I'm taking it this is, we're at the last part of the game, maybe? I hope so. Ships coming at me, more. Yep, I think I entered the danger zone. So, if you ever been a gamer, you should know this is like the like the type of trope they always do. They'll put you in like some kind of hard ass like mini game, and it always symbolizes that you're getting closer to the end than you think. Oh, jeez. So yeah, I can tell this is. I'm starting to think that I'm almost at the ending. Cause no, cause name me a game that uh, that always end up with somebody giving you like a lot of work to do before you get to the ending, like something extra. Okay, I think I screwed myself up here. Being dangerous. That did not work. Woo. I need some armor. I need it. I need all the armor I can get. 
Cause I can tell this is not gonna work out easy for me. Yeah, I'm getting. Yeah, we're close to ending. Cause they going all out, making sure I don't make it through. And this must be the ending. Oh yeah, this looks like the ending. All right, we about to get in. A gosh. So we in bleach now? <laughs> okay, I'm just joking. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Just hungry. <laughs> Oh, we okay. We have, we gotta be at the end because this looks very serious. All right, so I'm gonna save it here for now, but uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Uh, I know this is gonna be some BS, so um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be very interesting. So stay tuned for the next episode. Uh, we're gonna continue on to finish this game and. Hopefully we can move, have enough time to move on to the other games as well that my friend had recommended me to try out too. So stay tuned for that. And also stay tuned for more content coming from us, the GNT crew, uh, starting with Mega Brawl. Mega Brawl episodes are being done right now at this moment, and it's going to also come out pretty soon. Plus, um, uh, more episodes are going to be coming out soon for Anime Corner Twenty First. We're just working out some things on, you know, on our end as well. Um, but I, I want to like to send a shout out to a couple of people that helped out with the intro of the video. Um, shout out to Vexos, uh, shout out to him for the intro of the video of Anime Corner 21st. He also did the intro for GNT Maple Brawl as well. So make sure you check out his channel and you know, get a guy's support, you know, give him a thumbs up for every video he put up as well. And also give our channel a uh, thumbs up as well, such as Anime Corner 21st and GNT as well. So give us a thumbs up and subscribe and subscribe to our channel as well and share this with all your friends so that way they can enjoy some of the goofiness that we have talked about. <laughs> um, other than that, I'm your host, Demon Face Yoshi. This is Anime Corner 21st Gaming. And we'll see you in the next run with the conclusion, I hope, the conclusion of Kingdom Hearts. Peace.